Hello everyone. This project is called Cancer Facts and aims to shed a light on the most important concepts regarding this disease. Today, I'm going to talk about the genome. What is the genome? After the last video, you already know that cancer occurs when cells start to divide in an out-of-control manner. Why does that happen? Before we arrive at the answer, we must grasp a few key concepts and definitions. Let's start by defining a fundamental structure present in all human cells, DNA. DNA is basically made of molecules called nucleotides. There are four different types of nucleotides in DNA. They are represented by the letters A, T, C, and G. A for adenine, T for thymine, C for cytosine, and G for guanine. Each of these molecules, the nucleotides, must be paired with another one, adenine with thymine and cytosine with guanine. This creates a double strand, and this strand curls, making the famous double helix. The total of DNA in each cell consists of more than 3 billion nucleotide pairs and approximately 20,000 genes. Well, what is a gene? A gene is a section of DNA that carries instructions to make molecules, the proteins that allow cell survival and division. The DNA histone complex is called chromatin, and each basic unit is known as a nucleosome. Whenever nucleosomes are tightly packed, we call the resulting structure a chromosome. Each human cell has 46 chromosomes, 23 from each parent. These 46 chromosomes are what we call our genome. In this episode, you learn the basic constituents of our genome. In the next video, you will learn how small changes in our genome may affect the cell division process and cause cancer. This project is made by William Cortopassi, a PhD student at Oxford University studying new treatments for cancer with the support of Mendelic's genomic analysis. Bye!